Hey everybody, welcome to Shape It Up. We are talking about the ground rules for Thanksgiving so you can stay on track with your weight loss goals. So we all know Thanksgiving Day is considered a day where it's perfectly acceptable to overeat and I am not here to debate that with you. What I am here to do is to help you jumpstart your weight loss. This is why I give away so much free content. I wanna set you up for success. So if you're aiming to shed some pounds this Thanksgiving day, I suggest you set up some ground rules. In a previous episode, I talked about what to eat before you arrive for dinner and what kind of workout to do on Thanksgiving day. If you missed that information, go back and listen to the previous episodes. Now let's talk about some ground rules. The beauty of this is you get to decide what your ground rules are. In yesterday's episode, we talked about how do you want to feel when Thanksgiving Day is over. Again, if you didn't listen to that, I want you to stop this episode right here and go listen to yesterday's episode because you'll have a better understanding of how this episode will play into yesterday's. Okay, so hopefully you have done that and you've listened to that episode. So I would like you to imagine what your end goal is for Thanksgiving Day. So everybody's gonna have a different end goal. So I'm just going to use this as an example. So let's say you wanna feel comfortably full and satisfied with what you chose to eat. Now we're gonna set up the ground rules to get you your desired end of Thanksgiving day, okay? So if you wanna feel comfortably full and satisfied with the foods that you ate, what are you going to need to do during Thanksgiving? So rule number one might be, I will only have one serving of dinner food, meaning I'm going to have one plate of food. I will not go back for seconds. Next rule might be, I will only select to eat the foods that I absolutely love. Some other rules might be, I will be more aware of when I'm getting full. I will save a little room in my stomach for dessert I will drink four glasses of water while I'm at dinner. I will focus on the conversation and the people that I'm with as opposed to the food. So you get to decide what you want your rules to be. And I suggest that you pick three rules that you make for yourself, because if you have like 10 rules, chances are you're not gonna remember all of them. (laughs) So just pick three and you can type them in your phone if you want in your notes section and just look at them. You know, if you need a, a little reminder, I always like to do that for myself, but only pick three. Now, this is important because when Thanksgiving day arrives, your brain, like any other normal brain, is going to tell you that these rules that you made for yourself are totally stupid and you should just forget about them and do what you usually do for Thanksgiving day. Be on to yourself. If you wanna change your body, you will need to change what you normally do. Okay, so I hope you make your rules and I would love to hear how it went. So you can connect with me on Facebook, on the Shape It Up page, or on Instagram at Shape It Up with Nicole and my name is spelled N-I-C-O-L-E, and let me know how you do. If you're really confused and nervous and think you're gonna spin out and overeat on Thanksgiving Day, let's work together. I can help you navigate through the holidays. Your first step is to let me know you would like my help, and you can do that by booking a call with me today. Go to shapeitupfitness.com chat to get started. All right, I will talk to you tomorrow.